Hey y'all! Okay, so obviously by the title, there's a reason why I'm barefaced, why I'm up close. Um, I'm going to be showing you how I shave my face. You're probably like, oh my god, girl, you shave your face? Is you a man's? Is you growing a beard? Do you have a mustache? All that crazy stuff. You got sideburns? Honestly, I've always wanted to shave my face. And for the longest time, I was like so scared, like, you know, just to get rid of the peach fuzz and to just give you a nice clean base. I was always terrified and I was like, oh my God, my hair's going to grow back black. I'm going to get a moustache. I'm going to be a man. I'm going to be a man. Um, but yeah, I finally just did it one day and I've been doing it for, a, I don't know, maybe... Maybe a year or like less than a year now. I don't do it all the time. I was doing it like every month, but I haven't done it in a couple months just because, I don't know, I just haven't. But I thought I wanted to shave my face, freshen up my head, you know, exfoliate the whole shabam because I'm going out this weekend. It's a friend's 21st and I was like, I want my makeup to look flawless. There's obviously benefits to shaving your face. You get rid of the initial peach fuzz. It's an exfoliant. It gets rid of debris and the surface level of dead skin. It's like a really good exfoliation. Increases circulation and like blood circulation to the face, like vascular and like oxygen. It brings it all to the face, which is really good. So it has those benefits. And then on top of that, it just makes your makeup application look absolutely stunning absolutely flawless i swear to god so without further ado i'm going to teach you how to shave your face so obviously you want to get yourself an actual peach fuzz razor they look like this some people use them to shape their eyebrows um i don't because i don't want to accidentally shave off half my eyebrow you can get them pretty much anywhere. You can just look online and see where sells them, but they're usually fairly cheap. I got a pack of three and it like comes with like spare little blades for when they get ratchet. Um, and I think it was like $10, but that was probably the more expensive. Usually you can get them cheaper than that. Okay, so you've got your razor, you got your face. Um, you want to have a clean base. Now I have already washed my face, so she's pretty clean. So once your face is a clean base, um, then you can begin shaving your face. I'm actually going to take this piercing out. So the first thing you want to do, you want to like pull your skin sort of taut because you don't want it to be like all loose because then that can allow more nicks and cuts to happen. So you want it to be taut and you want the blade to be like kind of like tilted. Like on a 45 degree angle and you just want to go down always go um with the grain of hair oh my god look at that so always go with the grain of hair this is disgusting guys <laughs> this is all my bum for okay no one wants to see that that's nasty um i usually just keep like a something handy dandy so i can wipe all my hairs and whatever on so you just keep going around your face i usually start with my cheeks like my whole cheek area you want to press down kind of firm just like when you shave your legs or your arms or anything like that and also just be careful because this is a razor still and you can get cuts i like to go like this to get into my chin And all those skin cells as well which is like all that dead skin cell so good and I like to take it just like a little bit under my chin and down towards my neck but then I don't like to go like all the way down this is probably the most flattering angle you've ever seen of me but that's fine that's fine okay you get to your moustache area You know, just sort of like move your mouth so you can get all those hairs. Um, 
Some people like to go over their nose and I kind of do it like really briefly because I don't know. I just don't like to go for my nose that much, but I just, I will do it really, really briefly, like the sides here. I'll just do it really light because I just, I don't know, something about the nose, I'm like, hmm. now we come to the forehead um a little trick is to cover your eyebrow with your finger because you don't want to accidentally shave off your eyebrow i mean no one wants that you know I and mean, maybe some people do some people do it intentionally but i don't want that so um use your finger and pull it taut down and then just go over it oh my god I just shaved some of my hair off that's fine um you can go in between your eyebrows to get your mono brow but be really careful once again because you are going really close to your eyebrows and it's a dangerous game Okay, so once you're all done with that and you think you've got all the hairs, then you just want to cleanse your face. So you can just rinse your face with some soap. Um, I'm just making sure I've got all those little hairs off. Some witch hazel and a cotton pad and just go over my face with that. Oh. Now, your face may get um, a little bit irritated, but it will go down. And then you'll look glowy and beautiful. Like, yeah, your face may get a little bit irritated because we just fully exfoliated it and attacked it, but not in a bad way. But um, it will probably get a little bit yeah irritated and you might get a few small little bumps but just don't mess with it just do your normal um skin routine and girl she gonna be beautiful and usually it, it doesn't it takes like a few weeks for your peach fuzz to grow back so that's why i was doing it like every month you don't have to you can just do it whenever you feel like you want to or you can never do it again so once your face is exfoliated and cleansed you then want to add some hydration back to your skin because you just fully took it away i like to just add some oil this is a rose hip and jojoba oil just put a few drops on my hand and rub it together and i just like to pat it into my skin because um, it's a part of like the circulation finger magic, but I just like to pat it in. Okay, and then after I add my little bit of oil, I like to use a serum and some moisturizer. So I'm just going to take a bit of serum, just put that on. My face feels so good. Like, you guys have no idea. I feel so clean and fresh, and oh, my face just feels so good. So good, so good, so good. Actually, I'm not going to add moisturizer. I might just leave it at the oil and the serum because I feel hydrated enough. So that's it, guys. That's how I shave my face. Like a man.
look good. Um, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. If you're gonna try this, let me know in the comments down below and let me know your experience. Hopefully I'll see you in my next one. Bye!